Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today we're addressing a frustrating issue that many developers encounter when working with SonarCube. Our viewer is facing an error while trying to import an El Aviv report. The error message states that it could not resolve one file path, specifically pointing to an action creator file in their project. Let's dive into the details and see how we can help resolve this issue together. Welcome back to another tech video. Today I'm going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find the solution. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and you'll hopefully get to the resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. The error message indicates that Sonar Cube is unable to resolve a file path from your LCOV report. This usually happens when the paths in the LCOV report do not match the paths in your project structure. First, let's verify the path mentioned in the error. The unresolved path is slash meta workload slash Jenkins score score 251 jobs dead slash twos workspace common slash action slash action creators.js. Ensure that this file exists in your project directory. Next, review your l.info file. Open it and check if the paths listed there match the actual file structure of your project. If they do not match, you may need to adjust the paths in your LCOV report. If the paths are correct, consider adjusting the sonar.sources property in your sonar cube configuration. This property should point to the root of your source files. Make sure it includes the directory where the unresolved file is located. Finally, after making these adjustments, try re-importing the LCOV report into SonarCube. If the issue persists, check the SonarCube logs for more detailed error messages that can guide further troubleshooting. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're facing the SonarCube Elkov import error about unresolved file paths, here's a solution. You can change report path to report paths. For TypeScript projects, use a similar approach. Set the report path specifically for TypeScript. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one.